friends, it's me. And today we're checking out some of the coolest houses on TikTok. They have this really cool thing in their house. It's a room, but there's windows and stuff in it. But wait, it's filling up with water? Is it a pool? Can you actually like swim in it? Like you just flip a switch and then the floor gets filled up with water. Will it fill enough that they can actually swim or is it just like a kiddie pool? Like we just go and lay on the wet floor and pretend to swim. Like I really wonder how it works. Oh, this is kind of how that pool works. This house has it in a shower. So basically the ground goes under and then it fills up with water. So you could turn your shower into a literal pool. This is some next level luxury. I want my floor to just turn into a pool. Okay, you know, say less. For a million dollars, we can make anything happen. Would you also like a monkey to magically spawn and start giving you a shoulder massage before chomping down on a banana? Cause if you got the money, we can make it happen. This is the coolest game room I have ever seen in my life. This dude walks in through a Star Wars door, got his triple monitor set up. Walking into your gaming room is already like walking into a game. This doesn't even look real. Like how do you even do that? You're walking into a spaceship just to play your games. I feel like those monitors are too big. Oh yeah, smaller screens in front of him. You know, sometimes I forget money might actually buy you happiness. This is light up onyx and it is gorgeous. A movie room, a water fountain. Wait, it's red. Is that Kool-Aid? You got a Kool-Aid dispensing water fountain just casually in your house. That is quite the flex. You know, technically you can put whatever drink you want in the water fountain. If I wanted some flat Sprite, I could do it. When I think about what I want to eat and then remember my parents own a restaurant. Oh, that is the biggest flex. Oh, they own a pizza restaurant? Oh, that is actually the best. But like, is the restaurant downstairs? Like in your kitchen? Is that where they test out the recipes? And you could just be like, I'm hungry. Instead of ordering pizza, you got the restaurant in your kitchen. I'm trying to be like you, my boy. She got a 5,000 gallon aquarium in her house. That is massive. There's a whole ecosystem in there. She got baby shark. Do, 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 do. So it's just like a room with a massive aquarium. Hey, why are you feeding them country crop? I can't legally call it butter, huh? She like climbs on a ladder to feed the fish. I feel like this would be so much work to have this. I mean, even like a smaller aquarium is still so much work, but this one is like huge. And look at my dolphin go. Did she say she got a dolphin? And look at my dolphin go. You have a dolphin in your house. Now I'm sure you could even like go in there if you wanted to. My dad built me a secret room because I constantly think someone is going to murder me. Oh, take that stalker. Wait, if it's supposed to be secret, why make a TikTok on it? Now everybody knows that the bookshelf leads to your secret room. You know, I really hope you have a backup secret room. Or maybe this was a decoy and she really just hides under her bed. Yeah, you know, that's always the best place. Or in the cabinet under your sink, if you can fit. Ain't nobody gonna look there, are they? Me getting bored, but remember I have a bowling alley at home. You're not allowed to be bored if you have a bowling alley in your house. Let's walk through thousands of dollars of things I own before we get to the actual bowling alley. And yes, yeah, she wasn't kidding. It's like a gym on one side and then a bowling alley on the other. What? Yeah, you're not allowed to say you're bored when you got cool things like this in your house. Things in my friend's house that just make sense. A boiling tap. So I don't have to put water in the kettle and wait for it to heat up. You just have boiling water that comes out of a tap like instantly, just waiting for you. But imagine going over to somebody's house and you didn't know that was the boiling tap and you turn it on to wash your hands and then burn your hands off. <sighs> There's gotta be like a warning sign. A dishwasher cupboard. Oh, so it's hidden. You would never know that's a dishwasher. Under their microwave, they have a plate warmer. Wait, what's the point of that? It's like when you go to a restaurant and they're like, don't touch the plate, be careful, it's hot. I mean, it keeps the food warmer a little longer, but are you just a slow eater that you can't finish the whole thing before it gets cold? I don't know why they be putting microwaves on the island like that. You literally have to like get down on your knees if you wanna warm up a burrito. This is actually really nice. You like turn it on and it like completely fills your shower with steam. It's like you're in a sauna. Okay, your garage is really cool. You have a Lamborghini sign, but all I see are Ferraris. I don't think they're friends. Enemy cars. When I'm bored and remember I have bowling lanes at home. Another one. He's wearing a turtleneck and white pants at home. That means you know he is wealthy wealthy. Oh, okay. I thought the one bowling lane was impressive, but this dude walked into an entire bowling alley. Rich people really like bowling that much? They got hella lanes. If y'all got enough money to make a whole bowling alley, why not do like a laser tag room? Isn't that more fun than bowling? I think so. 
This is what a $30 million chandelier looks like. I'm sorry, did you add a couple of extra zeros? Who spends that much on a chandelier? And then I saw what it looks like. That is a lot of crystals. But bro, $30 million? Why the chandelier cost more than the house? Isn't that excessive? I know it's cool, but is it just me or did they not even center it on the table? It's looking a little off. I don't know, but if you're gonna spend that much money on something, wouldn't you want it to look perfect? I kinda don't like how it's like impaling the table at the bottom. It's just not the vibe. Stop! Uh, getting there. This is the built-in water dispenser just to get water when you get out of bed. Oh, that's fancy. You got that right in your bedroom. He basically got a water bottle filler in his bedroom. It does um, cool distilled water. Distilled water too? Oh, that's fancy. Whoa, 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 wait a second. Is that the bed? It's floating. And can we talk about the millwork that goes up to the roof? Oh, gorgeous. I had some custom porcelain uh, sinks. Porcelain sinks? I got that on my floor. You made a countertop out of it? Okay, but where's the soap? You just washed your hands with water and now you have some moisture. Hands. I'm just a hater because my bathroom is not this cool. Oh, actually, I take it back. There's no doors on the shower. I hate those showers. I need a door. I need it to be enclosed because I get cold. The second the water turns off, I am shivering. So I need a door on my shower. Two shower systems because there's like 14 body sprays in here. 14 body sprays? And you're only gonna end up using one of them. A fireplace in the shower? What? Okay, now I understand why you don't have doors. You just turn on the fireplace and it's nice and toasty as soon as you shut off the water. Okay, okay. And a window right next to the shower so the neighbors can spy on you if they really wanted to. They are building a pool in this backyard. What is she spraying? Is she spraying the concrete on? Hey, that ain't water. Oh, gamer pool, gamer pool, gamer pool. It's got color changing LEDs and a cave where you can swim in with a waterfall. Oh man. Yeah, you really have to trust the process with this one. They really said, make my entire backyard a pool. I don't want no grass, no trees, none of the foliage. I want pool and fire and LEDs, make it happen. And they did. You know these guys that build houses from scratch? Somehow I always end up finding and watching their videos at three in the morning. You know when you watch a video and you're like, yeah, I can do that, but no matter how many of these videos I watch, yeah, I can't do that. There is no way. How did it get so smooth? They are building a water slide. I blinked and now there's this whole foyer built underground. You know, if cavemen were this good, society would now look like this. They somehow built fountains out of bamboo and we have this whole water park that you could slide down the cylinders that they were digging before and into the water. The water looks a little sus, but that looks really fun. They really built their own water park. Not even in the backyard, just in a random spot in the jungle. Me, once a month when I remember there is a jungle gym in my basement. Hey! She wasn't kidding. She got the slides. This is actually really cool. Like, where do you even buy this from? Do you just like Wayfair, Jungle Gym, and you can just buy these for your house? What? You can. No way. Yeah, you can just buy this with Apple Pay right now. Low price of 114000 But like, you would be buying it brand new. No other kids would have like slobbered, snotted, or pissed themselves on these. You really can Google and buy any anything, huh? Oh, those are pretty panels. Is that a closet in there? Oh no, it's the kitchen. So you can just hide the kitchen. Do some people think their kitchen is ugly or something? Like, I wanna hide it. I can't have my wealthy and affluent guests seeing that I even own a kitchen. Ugh, what am I? Poor. Oh, she got an elevator, so. Oh my goodness, that's cool. So they have these doors. They're very expensive, but basically, when you press a button, it fills up with like gas, so you can't see through it. And then you you could just like instantly turn it off and then be able to see through it. It's like magic. I was gonna do this for my front door and then they told me how much it was gonna cost and I was like, mm, no thank you. Once a month when I'm bored and remember I have alpacas in my garden, like the animals. Oh, oh, they're so cute. So you can literally just go outside and you got like a petting zoo in your own backyard. I feel like that every time I wake up, I go downstairs and I see my dogs. I only have three, but it's like, well, personal petting zoo but I also got to feed them and clean after them everyone wants 
live out in a castle until they find out. The Wi-Fi never works, it's always freezing cold, cleaning takes ages, and if you want something, you have to walk a marathon. Do people actually want to live in like a castle, like a big one? I mean, I understand like a small one. A castle is just not very practical. Sorry to crush your castle living dreams. I just imagine it to be like huge, cold, and empty, and just like a ton of rooms. Like what are you gonna do with a ton of rooms? Also, you lost me at Wi-Fi. Client says, I want hidden access to weapons when I cook. <gasps> oh, there is a secret compartment. And by weapons, I mean wooden ladle, so I can stir my naughty soup. I don't even see knives. Is there a secret compartment under the secret compartment that you are not showing me? I guess something like this is really good for like hiding clutter. Like if you don't like things on your countertops, but need things on your countertops. The equivalent of having a closet door. Closet messy? No problem. Just close the door. Don't see mess anymore. But anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment below and let me know which one was the coolest one. And make sure you turn on notifications. Click, click. And make sure you hit that like button in the face. And subscribe to Join the Wolf Pack. Oh, I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.